right, so today's video um, and homework from the Knights Hall as part of the online class is really working on uh, the fundamentals of the most basic sword strike, right? And throwing the sword strike uh, specifically the way we do in armored combat uh, so as not to um, cause tendonitis in your elbows or pain in your shoulders if you're throwing lots of strikes, if you're fighting with heavier weapons like a heavy falchion in a melee, uh, and also to protect yourself. So I'm going to walk through real basics of it. Uh, again, uh, my name is Chuck Goodman. If you're the first time you look at this channel, uh, I'm not an instructor. I'm training. I just like to post these videos to kind of help me focus and uh, teach myself. Uh, and hopefully other people get a little bit of information out of it. Uh, so this is just my understanding of it. Uh, and to keep it simple and kind of go into the mechanics. The first thing I've talked about before in videos is that loose grip. So a grip sort of like this where I'm basically levering my hand and then I have loose grip around it, right? So I can kind of move that sort around. Second piece we're doing is we're throwing the shots right now for B guard, so basically shield up and sword on my shoulder. Um, to start, so within B guard, I'm throwing a shot, and instead of swinging way out here and extending and using all of my arm, I'm trying to use my hip and my body motion primarily. So I'm keeping my elbows in. I'm throwing that shot, and I'm actually snapping out. I'm almost throwing a punch. And as I do that, I'm rotating, and I'm trying to snap to that point. So I'm keeping my elbow in tight. Uh, again, that protects me, one, from getting a blown up with shots underneath here, uh, and also keeps me from using my arm over and over again and fatiguing uh, the elbow joint, fatiguing the shoulder, things like that. So I'm throwing that shot in tight, and basically, I'm, again, I'm throwing a punch out, essentially. A punch like that, my knuckles are aligned with, my bl uh, with the blade, so where I push those knuckles, the blade goes, and I'm throwing that shot out from my core. Now I can then move that shot without moving my knuckles. So if I go out here, I can pop the knuckle up, throw the shot here, can drop the knuckle down, throw the shot low, without really changing very much uh, in the actual mechanics of it. So my homework is 300 strikes, I'm at 150 both hands. Again, I'm a lefty, so I prefer this one, but I'll do it this way too. So again, I'm punching that out. I'm not swinging way out here. I'm not extending. I'm keeping my arms in in a fight, throwing that shot fast. And B guard is the easiest place to start out of. So it's on your shoulder, it's already kind of cocked back. You can just punch it out. If I'm throwing a different guard, like an A guard, like this, where I got my shield up, protecting myself, which I fight in often. Similar idea, I'm just gonna throw it like this. So same thing, it's keeping that elbow in and that shoulder in. So it's going to come around and snap, 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 snap. Doing it righty. Never actually fighting righty, but it's good to train both sides. What I'm trying to avoid doing is drawing it all the way back and throwing a huge shot. It's going to get blocked with the personal move. Um, this is especially effective, I think, uh, for me at least. And melee, if I'm doing the shield and sword, if I'm throwing from here and I'm throwing that shot in, I can just chop down real hard, keeping that. I'm just punching out onto a shoulder, onto a hip, onto whatever's available, right inside the head. Drop it down to the shoulder. And the idea is rotate the whole body through using your hips instead of just your arms and your wrists. Because this gets tiring. Try to do that. That's it. Uh, real simple today. Most basic strike uh, we have. Again, I'm using my uh, waster from Hickory Arms, uh, the favorite my favorite place to get uh, training weapons. These guys are awesome. I can put a link in below. If you want to train more or learn more about this, you can go to armoredcombatsports.com or the Knights Hall. I actually wearing the Knights Hall shirt today, uh, where I train and fight for the team that I fight for. Uh, if you have any questions, um, leave a comment below. You can follow me on Facebook under the Woodchuck Knight or follow the, the page.